Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today I want to share with you guys something so special and it is this amazing reborn baby cuddle body and um, it is actually exactly the same cuddle body as I used in my last cuddle baby video which I will post a link in the upper right hand corner. The only thing different is that this cuddle baby body is this beautiful dark brown color and the reason why it is this color is because the body that I'm going to <clears throat> this body, I'm sorry, this body I am using for a ethnic reborn head, which is actually the baby that you guys saw in the beginning of the video. So if this is news to you, I would like you to know that Janie, which is the lady that makes the cuddle baby bodies, and I will post a link in the description box so that if you would like to order one, you can. Um, uh, you can contact her through Facebook but anyway, she makes these bodies in three different colors. So you can get a fleshy color, which is the ones that I always order. You can get um, a more medium brown color, and then you can get this dark one that you're looking at right here. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and start weighing the body. I have already applied polyfill in the bottom part of the cuddle body. And now I'm ready to add my glass beads. And these are the glass beads that I like to use. Um, I do buy them off of eBay. Sometimes I use some more thicker bead, but most of the time those are not available. So this is my second best uh, liked glass bead. So I'm going to go ahead and put those inside a panty hose and tie that right up and go ahead and insert it inside of the cloth body. And now I am adding my second layer of polyfill and it is important that you make sure that your polyfill is hugging the little glass of beads that you just put in the body so that the reborn mommy doesn't feel the beads through the cloth body. And now we are ready for our second little glass of beads and I'm going to go ahead and insert that right on top of the second layer of polyfill. And finally I'm going to add a third layer of polyfill and again you want to make sure that the polyfill completely hugs <laughs> the little glass of beads so that you cannot feel the beads um, through the outside of the cloth body. Finally, I'm going to add a third little bag of glass beads. Um, this is optional. I find that if I add a third one very close to the head, it helps with um, head support. It doesn't make the reborn baby so floppy, and it helps the reborn baby hold the, its head up. I know it's not very common for newborn babies, but some mommies don't like very floppy babies, so this is an option. Um, if you like your babies a little bit more floppy with their head bouncing around, then and do not add this third little bag of glass beads. And finally, of course, I'm gonna go ahead and attach the head. We are now ready to dress our cuddle baby. And of course, the first thing that we're going to put on this baby is this cute little diaper. This is the Honest brand diapers. Um, I just got these from Target, so they are a new print. And of course, they're Christmassy, which is perfect for the season. And I will be sending a few extra of these diapers so that if the mommy decides to change her diaper, she can. And now I'm going to put on these cute little Carter socks. And I absolutely love the little bowl at the back of the socks. They are just so adorable. And last night I went to Target and I picked up this amazing little outfit from Cat and Jack. Um, I got it in zero to three months just because the newborn size one looked a little bit small to me and I thought it might just fit too snug especially because she's a cuddle baby I thought it might be a little bit tight on the limbs so I went and I got her a zero to three month outfit
and now it is time to add her colorful mittens and I also picked these up last night at Target they are the Gerber brand um, unfortunately Cat and Jack doesn't have um, mittens that would have matched this outfit so I had to pick what I thought would have fit best anyway here she is and she is now ready to go home but first of course she wants to say hello to mommy and um, she wants to say that she cannot wait to be home and it is time to get her fed just like all my other babies so please enjoy <laughs> 